and we're back with another raw recap. Number four. And here we go now. What? Um, Ashley. Melissa. Justin. And now we got. Raw. Monday Night Raw. Which and was good. It was actually good. Yeah. I mean, yeah. A little hectic in the beginning, but. Nothing spectacular, but still good. Yeah. I mean, I think uh, something with Van Corbin, Stephanie. Yeah, let's see. Stephanie was hit, was upset with last week because remember, Baron Corbin put himself in a title match against Roman Reigns and lost. So Stephanie is like saying, I think is rethinking her decision of making of putting Baron Corbin in a position of power and bringing yeah. back Kurt Angle. Yeah. No, we don't. We're not 100 sure she's going to. She says. If you lose, I might think about putting her angle back and taking away your job. So. So that's not. So there's that was that. And then let's see, we got. Well, yeah. Stephanie. Well, Stephanie told him, "Yeah, you're gonna go against the Shield, but you have to find two partners." Yeah, and. So the whole time till the main event. Of course, you're, we're thinking, oh, what's his partner going to be? Probably Braun or somebody? That's who you're probably thinking. Oh, that's probably who he's going to book it. Nope. But, yeah. No. But, anyway, to start of the match, matches, we got Finn Balor versus Jinder Mahal. And Bailey was with Finn. And Alicia was with Jinder. Because they're doing the... That um, mixed challenge thing. Mm-hmm. Um... Of course. Finn won, but, but with help from Bailey. Yeah, because Bailey did, um... Bailey pulled on... What, did he? Did she pull um, Junior Mahal's leg, which caused him to trip? Yeah, and also... Because and then I ended up getting Foxy and... Samil. Ba ba Bailey in it, and then the, yep. Sunil, the Sunil Singh brothers. She got a, 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 ba a Bailey, Bailey hug. Belly. Bailey, Bailey. And boom! Which of course caused made... distraction. Yep. And yep. then one via roll up, right? Yep. So yeah. So that I mean that match. And then he attack. Then, um, Jinder attacks Samil, put him in the ring. Then him, Alicia, and Samin were doing the Shanti chant. Yeah. After him beating. Which was weird. After him yeah, beating was... up the Singh mm, brother. Really creepy. Okay, that that poor guy is in an abusive relationship. <laughs> there you go. Why is no one? Why is no one saying anything? Why is do, nobody doing anything to him for him? He's being beaten up by his spouse. Yeah, I don't know. He's like he's like the woman. <laughs> also, they um also had the thing with the um the Connor kids. Yeah. That was that was really good. That was really yeah, nice. Yeah, superstars. Yeah, well, the super's coming out, and they um. They showed the Hyundai car yeah. with all the superstars and the kids. Yeah, with their hands friends. on the car. And then we got the two the the two kids yep. stepping into the ring with Stephanie and Triple H, and they end up getting titles of their own. Yep. That was really cute. And the, yeah. the best part was the fan, the whole WWE Universe cheering. Yeah, and the fans saying, you, you deserve, deserve it. it. They, do, deserve they it. do deserve it because they survive. They yeah. fight. Well, fight to survive to live. Well, yep. bravo to the fans for cheering that. Bravo. Congrats. So. All right. All right. Next Our match. next match is Natalia, Brie Bella, and Nikki Bella. Versus the Riot Squad. And, okay, of course. Um, well, the surprise was the Riot Squad won that one. Of course, because Ruby Riot gave her her special kick, and that's how she won the match. Yeah. Well, let's see. During the, uh, like, towards the end, what was it? Shit. What was the one squad member? I know yours is the blonde was Liv Morgan, but I always forget. Sarah that. Logan? The one that's supposedly a Viking? Sarah Logan. I'm Norwegian. I'm descended of Vikings. I do not sense... <laughs> I do not sense no Viking in her blood. Freaking <laughs> Eric Rowan is... 
friggin' Viking. I could tell with the redheaded beard. There's no way. But, anyways, when Natalia was throwing, uh, doing one of those um, Irish whips to the uh, rope, uh, Ruby Riot tagged Sarah Logan, and Natalia was doing the um, her submission move to Sarah Logan, and then Ruby Riot came in, kicked her in the face, and then did her um, riot kick, which then and then they won, pinning her one two three. Yeah. yeah. That was an interesting match, too. But it's hyping up for... Yeah, the hype for that Ronda Rousey and the Bella Twins versus the Riot Squad at Super Showdown, October 6th. Which I can tell is that the the uh, the Bella Twins with Ronda Rousey are going to win. Yeah. Of course, it's Ronda Rousey. What do you yeah. expect? You need someone who can physically beat her. Yeah. She's going to be the Brock Lesnar of the f- female division. Maybe they should dig up, dig up one of the old females. and Maybe they can find someone that's... Maybe Lita. Or Trish Stratus. Yeah. They got beef, to they gotta beef them up. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, what's the next one? Chad Gable versus Connor. Man. Isn't anybody else getting a little bit, like, tired of that rivalry? Guilty. I am, too. Because it's like, how many now? Like, this is the fourth or fifth time I've been saying Ascension with Chad and Rude. Why did they go against someone else? Yeah, like like I've been saying, change up the matches. But Connor won. But Connor actually won. That's a surprise. Yeah. That's that, not, it's not really interesting with that match, really. It just that no. Connor won him It's over. a time filler. I mean, Bobby Roode, like, listening to his entrance and stuff, that's fun. Yeah. Who don't like Bobby Roode? Glorious! <laughs> also, throughout the matches, um, they tried to get Dean to go to... Yeah. Yeah. They were trying to First, get... First, it was, it was um, Dolph Ziggler telling him at ringside... Saying that Dean, you should ch- uh, quit the the shield because they're using you. I don't care that. about you. Yeah. And then it was um. I am. Um, Dolph again, talking to Dean in private. Yeah. And then, then later t- on, Seth Rollins went to Drew McIntyre and switched that role up, saying, "Um, Braun Strowman and Dolph Ziggler." Are doing probably doing the same to you, since you first showed up. Dolph Ziggler's been riding your coattails. Yeah, I mean, I like Dean. If he ever did turn heel, I'll still like him. I'll never turn on him. But <laughs> I'm glad he's still with the shield. Oh yeah, but I could still see it probably happening. But I'm never gonna. I won't turn on Dean if he turned. Cause I'm always, I'm always a Dean. Speaking yep. of Dolph Ziggler and all Yeah, that. Dolph Ziggler and Drew had a Raw Tag Team title match against The Revival. And that was a actually pretty close match because towards The Revival almost won. Yeah, The Revival actually almost won. They were this close. This close. I mean, I mean, at least they got their title match chance. They got a chance. That's good to give others chances that they needed, like The Revival and all that. But of course they didn't win, but you know. That was still an exciting match. Yeah. Yep. Now Elias. Well, first off, Elias comes out, he does a stupid crappy thing. Well, he didn't perform. He said that he wasn't going to perform. He sat in the ring and then he called out Kevin Owens. Because it was the Kevin Owens show. And then they started teasing Bobby Lashley's thing. I forgot what his name is. Leo Rush? Leo Rush. Yeah, Leo Started Rush. teasing him. They even put Elias, we even put one of those baby bumper seats <laughs> in the chair. Started teasing him and everything. Um, and then Leo Rush announced and nope. brought out Bobby Lashley. Called him out. And He's like, hey, I someone will love that joke and Bobby Lashley coming out. And then... Bobby Lashley versus Elias. They've, you know, did their match or whatever, but it turned out to be a DQ. Because yep. Leo Rush 
was running around the ring, and Kevin Owens kept chasing him, and while Leo Rush ran past Bobby Lashley, Kevin Owens accidentally kicked Bobby Lashley. So Bobby won by disqualification. Yeah. yeah. He and it's lucky that Bobby came in when the match was over because Kevin Owens was oh. super close oh, to yeah. giving Leo Rush the Kevin Owens powerbomb. Yeah. Yep. Bobby oh. Lashley got there just in a nick That would have been a big old freaking problem. A big old lawsuit. <laughs> Yeah, but then again, you you stepped in the ring, so if you get your ass kicked, that's on you. Well, I mean, he is a twenty three year old small little shrimp, so <laughs> that's why why Elias put that stupid baby yep. bump there. <laughs> he probably would fit. He probably would. It looked small. He's skinny enough. <laughs> Next, little... I'm pretty sure next time they're probably gonna have a pacifier or a binky or something. Yeah, probably or a diaper bib and all that and it says Bobby Lashley's boy or something. Yep. Mama's boy. Alright. Next is a woman's match and it was Nia Jax with Ember Moon for Alicia Fox. I mean, of course. I'm not, I mean, well, Alicia Fox well, Alicia Fox had Bliss and James. Always. Bliss and Bliss had these uh, gloves and jacket that you could have Bed because of Connor's cure. Yeah. So. Which is pretty nice. That's cool how they do that bid thing where you can bid for. Yeah, all the proceeds and all that go to the. Especially when they're signed. Yeah. Especially that. If you but, were at a bid, you can put it in glass frames and just keep it. Yeah. Protected. But Nia Jax won. Oh, of course. But it's still nice to see Nia Jax trample and yeah. run over um, Alicia Fox. Yeah. I think Fox has now become one of those joke characters. Yeah. That is just I don't met... think she'll ever... I don't think at least Fox will ever have the woman title or whatnot, so... Unless they ch she changes... They let her change her role because she's act she acts like the cuckoo crazy lady. Oh my god. I remember the freaking thing where she got all crazy and going... Ah! Just to destroy everything. I was like, oh man. Wasn't that yeah. the, the reason why she went cuckoo crazy? Because all the boys or whatever kept dumping her? I think so. I remember how she went crazy with the Cedric Alexander one, too. I was like, what? Boy. Is that all they're going to use her for? No title runs, just that. <sighs> oh, and then the main event. That shield versus Baron Corbin and his p opponents. Well, his partners. Yeah. Well, yeah. Po I said opponents. Oops. Partners. AOP. He picked AOP. Lots of pain. And, of course. During the middle of the matches, Braun Strowman and his two lackeys, Come Dol out. Dolph Ziggler and Drew McIntyre, we're just sitting, we're sitting standing. Sitting there watching, and they were hoping Dean's going to turn on them. They're just waiting. But, nope. You call it, Ashley. You say it. Shield's your thing. But. What happened in the match? But. Um. No, Dean's like, no, no. No, the Shield won. Yeah, the Shield won. I'm saying. Roman. Roman won by Spear and... But he stole Dean's thunder. Yeah, I think Dean was in there doing it all fired up and all that, and that's how... And then didn't Roman get tagged in? Roman like... got tagged in and speared him and went to win. Yeah. So, but, and then Dean sitting there outside the ring while Seth and Roman are sitting and standing and looking at him, like, hoping Dean doesn't go with them because you have the other guys, Braun and Ziggler... And Drew sitting there yep. ho hoping he'll go that way. Ziggy Wiggy, of course. <laughs> Was hoping he would join. And Dean's like... But they're getting there. And then he ran back in the ring and did the fist pump shield because he's like, I'm sticking with my brothers. Yep. It's gonna happen. It's not yet. But if it ever does happen, I always love Dean. Yep. I like the shield. That's my favorite team. 
You just like Dean. That's all you do. You just like Dean, no matter what. So, Even if they put Dean in the Ascension, you'll still like him. Ugh. I don't like Dean, but I don't like the other guys. Yuck. Okay. But, so, what do you think is going to probably happen next week? So, what do you think? Are they going to... What do you think is going to happen with the shield? No, Baron Corbin. That's the thing. And he Baron lost. Corbin, is he going to be still the temporary GM thing? Or are they going to bring back Kringle? Or... Write in the comments how you feel. Yeah, write what do you think is going to happen for next week, or how you felt about tonight's Raw, and whatnot, and... I mean, I say it was pretty good. Yeah. It was pretty good. It was okay. So, I mean, yeah. But, make sure you like. Comment. Subscribe. If you want more Raw Weekend. Bye! Bye.